Benny Mardonis, who sang Into the Night, has died. He was 73. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Stream Music. He died at his home in California, which was confirmed by Joel Diamond, who we, we have talked to in the past about the music industry. He passed after a long battle with Parkinson's disease. He was born in Cleveland, Ohio, served in Vietnam, then moved to New York, where he worked with Joel Diamond, writing songs for Brenda Lee and Tommy James, among others. It was the album Never Run, Never Hide, which didn't do that well, that produced Into the Night, though, a song that would have many lives. As Billboard reported this morning, you know, it was interesting. He was 33 years old and he's singing about a 16-year-old, which made some people uncomfortable. Not the first to actually do that. There have been many songs throughout the years. And even Mardonis had said the song, who we co-wrote, was about a platonic love, about a neighbor's daughter who was kind of left on her own. Into the Night peaked at number 11 in 1980 in September of that year. The song really had one of those kind of Phil Spector wall of sound kind of build-ups. I mean, he was thick. Even Benny Mardonis was like a Pavarotti fan. He made it big. And I remember I was working at one of the biggest radio stations in Western Canada when we started playing a different version. Even though that different version came out in 89, I remember I was in, I joined the staff a year later and I'm going, why are we playing a different version of it? Famous radio DJ Scott Shannon had found the song again, started playing at the new version, and it reached number 20. In the year 2000, he was diagnosed with Parkinson's and though he kept performing it mostly in the New York area, by 2017, he had to quit all the shows as he worsened. Interestingly, Joel Diamond put together a remix of Into the Night, and it got a third stint on the charts, reaching number 35 of the dance club songs. Can you believe that? You know, he only had one hit on the top 40 charts, but man, it had legs. And Into the Night was one of those songs that was almost like it, it, it had a, a feel of Engelbert Humperdinck, which was not uncommon in the 70s. It was a classic rock ballad where fans from different genres would somehow appreciate it. May he rest in peace. Make sure you comment on our video, subscribe to our channel, and share our video. Do you have a history with Benny Mardonis? You see him in concert, ever know the guy? Leave your comments. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Stream Music.